Hello, Cup Coders, and welcome back to the Cup Code server. Now, we did just finish the upgrade, and I know the last episode I went in administrative mode and I was showing you around and some of the things that were broken. Um, one of the major things that was broken is a lot, technically a lot of the Ars Magica blocks disappeared from the world or were changed into something else. So what I had to do last week is I had to run around and see if I couldn't find a bunch of them that were used in builds and replace them. And that's been done. So now we're back to doing the survival thing. But I've had to move the survival home to a new location. And so I did not rebuild it. So you're aware. Um, I did use administrative mode to copy and paste the entire building from where it was to where it sits now and then I went back to where it was and I deleted and replaced what was there um, essentially I removed the house and and the, the spell crafting altar and level out the ground so all the trees and everything are still there but the house is not the house is literally right here and nothing in the house has been changed all the boxes are just as they were you know some of the items might have been moved around in the process of, of doing the move but it's all the exact same items in the boxes that were there before and this even includes the furnaces and everything so everything's still back in place as it was um it did move i did move yeah it did move my protection stone as well so the old location is no longer protected by me this new location is now protected as you can see when i walk out of the house it says i left my area all right so but we are going to need to remake the spells so let me show you what happened there these were the spells so as you can tell these are no longer spells these are now focus crystals so we're not going to be able to use them as spells anymore they're now just renamed focus crystals is all they are they're nothing more than that so i'm going to have to remake the spells that we want to use and that's just fine i mean the only spells we had that because futz was broken we had magic bold and dig but the danger problem here is that we got we're gonna have to make those books again so we're pretty much starting kind of from scratch i mean i've lost my ability to, to cast spells because my spells were broken so we're gonna head out and we're gonna see about gaze gathering some of the materials that we need to make the books now we have sugarcane and paper in fact, we should probably go ahead and plant some sugarcane right out here while we're at it. Let's pick a nice location. I think right in here is good. I think right in there is actually perfect. Perfect, perfect. So we'll put the rest of this sugarcane back in here. Um, let's see. Do we have leather? We probably don't. We have one piece of feather and we have plenty of ink sacks. So we're going to need some... We're going to need some leather, so we're going to have to go find some cows and kill them. Um, I think that's it. We should still have... Yeah, here's our arcane compendium. So we still have the compendium, so I'm still good on that. See, it's still showing all the same stuff that was there previously, so we're good on that. All right, so we need a weapon. I think I just lagged. There we go. Um, so grab this stone sword. And because I am a wizard, I'm not allowed to use iron swords. So we're not even going to bother making one. But we are going to make a stone sword. Another stone sword. Did I... Now, seriously? I think I'm going to have to re-log. I think I might have lagged the system. Grab the sword. Alright. And I don't think what it, the problem here is not the server, by the way, just so you know. It is my connection. My, I do have a semi slow. For some reason, my internet connection has been slowing down here at the house. And I just haven't called my ISP to figure out why it's been happening. But it's not the server. The server's been fine. I have have seen there have been other people that have been logged into the server and they have not been complaining. And I've been 
testing the server, so to speak, from different locations. Like I can log in from work and not have any problems whatsoever. Whereas, you know, I log in from home and I am having problems. So I know that this is not an issue with the server. This is an issue with me, my connection. So I just have to deal with it until I get it fixed. Much, 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 much. All right, let's go see if we can't find some cows. Moosers. We need some moosers. Because we need some lezers. I really should bring some cows back. What is that? A donkey. Yeah, donkey. Hey, there's some cows. I really should bring some cows back and start a farm-ish. But... And you see... But I see. There we go. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Do 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 do. All right. Keep going. Maybe next uh, next week. But hopefully by next week, this will be resolved. This is not an issue with the server. This is with my connection. Well, it also doesn't help the fact that when I'm... We're... Oh. <laughs> it also doesn't help the fact that when I'm recording, I'm recording upstairs on a laptop using a wireless connection to my router, which is connected to my modem. And then let's see, let's do the math here. There's a desk, a floor, a wall, another wall, another wall, and a TV entertainment center in the in between my laptop and the the, the modem, the router. So it's quite a bit of stuff that's interfering with the signal. So it, that's part of the problem that I'm having is at such distance. But that's something that I can't re really fix because in order to fix that. I would have to go and record downstairs and I, I do my recordings up here because well I have a door that I can close you know I'm in my bedroom I have a door I can close I get some privacy I can record without having to worry about people walking in on me most times and it's not as loud I don't have to worry about oh well I don't have to worry about getting you know audio from the TV over my recording or anything like that which you know most of you already know that that could be you know copyright issues you know I could have you know some kind of it, that could cause problems that we don't want to deal with so I, that's why I record upstairs so that I have the privacy and I have the quiet All right, so let's see that and it's just more comfortable up here All right, so we have the leather so we only have one piece of you dirty rats seriously one piece of leather after all those cows you guys are cheap. Cheap, cheap, cheap cows. You deserve to get killed. Hey, do you drop leather when I kill you? Let's find out. You don't drop anything. And you take more hand damage. Blimey, that sucks. All right, I guess we're still on the hunt for cows then. We're gonna probably gonna spend the rest of this episode looking for cows. Moomers. Come here, Moomer. Picking up leather. Yes, yes, I want your leather. I don't care about your meat, give me my leather. I said yes, don't tell me no. Every time you hit him, no, no, no. Tell me no. And see, I'm not so much worried. Like on the other games, when I play, I uh, always worry about getting lost out in the wilderness. I'm not worried about that on the server because we have warps and stuff. No. That's another benefit to playing on a multiplayer server. Now, of course, you could set that up on a one-player game as well. Um. You can get, I think it's called single player commands or something like that, but I haven't had any luck getting them working, so. And that's part of the reason why I went and got this server. Just. I think it's awesome to be able to just warp home. And speaking of warping home, I think we might have to warp home soon. It's becoming nighttime, and we don't have any spells. 
You have no mana. Hey, if I stay near you, will you help protect me? Of course not. You're a nature mage. You won't lift a finger. They don't. Seriously. I have never seen them lift a finger to fight an enemy. They just stand there. And the enemies don't attack them either. I don't get it. They're weird. Okay. All right. Is this a result of the upgrade? I mean, have I gone back into explored territory? That's part of the problem, guys. I mean, if you, if on the server because we did the upgrade, if you go back to ex previously explored area, you're gonna find some weird stuff like that. So the best way of knowing when you come onto the server, if you're looking for a place to build. Keep an eye, watch out for the blue orchids. The mo as soon as you see blue orchids, you know that you've gone far enough that there's Ars Magica stuff being generated. And we are just wandering and wandering and looking for cows and we're not having any luck. And I do think that this is an indication that we are back in pre-generated stuff. Oh, the server is going to restart in 15 minutes. Wow, I am never on it this time. That's just insane. But that is that is a scheduled restart. It happens every night at about midnight, I think. Die. Die. All right, well, there goes my... Oh, 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 oh. It's the nature mage, isn't it? He's protecting you. Both of them. That one and that one. They got spells on you. I can't kill you because of the ma nature mage. Blarmy! Ooh. I'll take that. Thank you. There it is. Let's see, I knew I saw another one. I do think, though, that we're going to have to cut this episode short because I'm lagging bad enough that it's going to affect the game. Um, for instance, other than just picking stuff up, enemies can kill me easily because, well, as you can see, I'm glitched out. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to warp back. Now, I'm using warps. You guys actually here. Home survival. Let's just do that. So I have already set a home point here. So we're going to go ahead and end this episode here because, like I said, it's lagging out bad enough for me, and it's not an issue of the server. This is, for me, it is a network problem. Um, hopefully I'll have this fixed soon. But I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here, A, because of the lag, and B, because, well, the server is about to restart here in 15 minutes anyways. And, yeah, well, there it is. But I want to say thank you, as always. Thank you for watching. Just a like, comment, share. Let me know you care. We'll see you in the next episode.